I was asked to check upon a dog that had been admitted earlier that afternoon. In my job, I come across a lot of strange cases, but this condition was particularly rare. This is a really interesting case. This is Bash, she's a seven month old Weimaraner. If we have a good look at her, there's a few very interesting things. Her front legs are all splayed, they're all bent here, round her ulna, it curves all the way around. The same on this one here. If we have a look at her jaw, it's really overshot. Now, she's not in pain and she's not suffering with this condition. What she is, is a dwarf. And an, a seven month old Weimarad, you'd expect to be quite a bit bigger. These dogs in Sweden, they're historically guard dogs. They're actually colloquially known as the ghost dog. And they're notorious for having a little bit of edge about them. Now, the reason she's turned up here is because the other litter mates were picking on her at home and the owners just couldn't cope anymore with her getting bullied. And it was either put her down or abandon her or drop her off here at the GSPCA. Now, I've never seen a case like this. It's called hypopituitary dwarfism or growth hormone deficiency. And unfortunately for her, she's a bit too old to undergo growth hormone supplementation. And that would be the only sort of treatment that might help her. The best thing we can do is to spay her because there's evidence that this condition could be genetically carried forward to other dogs. And we don't want her breeding on because as she gets older, unfortunately, with these deformities, she's gonna suffer some arthritis. It's gonna be very difficult to rehome her as well because I'm not convinced she's, she's the full ticket, unfortunately. Good girl.